Hi guys, this is Simmer Down Girl, and welcome to episode. Who I'm not even sure, like fourteen or fifteen, not sure. Um, because I'm doing them consecutively. So, I in the last parts I gave Mrs. Mona here a well, not in the last part, in between the last part, I gave Little Miss Mona here and makeover and she looks so cute and she has on a backpack I wonder why no I installed the go to school mod so that she can go to school so I'm like so excited to get her to school and finally check out the go to school mod I have been putting it off for a while now and now it's the perfect time Mona aged up she's a child and yeah so we're gonna take her all the way from elementary school to high school and beyond well yeah so we're gonna grow with Mona and I'm so excited I know in the last part I asked um, if you guys wanted her to have a sibling I don't really know your responses because like I said I'm playing this consecutively so um, I won't see them before this but I think Mona is going to be an only child I just feel like her parents are so busy with work that there's just no way that they could raise another child and so I'm going to keep it like that unless anything changes. So let's get into playing this because I'm so excited. I can't wait to go to school and try out this mod that everyone else has been doing for the last two months or so. And I just haven't done it yet. So enough blabbing. Let's get on with it. Like I really, really hope today is a school day, which is probably a Sunday. With my luck, it's Sunday. Um, where can I see what day is? Okay, right here. It is. It is <laughs> Sunday. So she does not even have school today. Ugh. I feel cheated. But okay, so um, her dad does have to work. So. Or oh, wait. Wait a minute. No, I think it's... It's Sunday evening right now, so she does have school in the morning, so she needs to... Oh, we need to get her a bed. We need to get her a bed. Let's go and do that. Let's get her, get this crib and baby stuff out of here. Because she is a child now. And she no longer has to deal with baby items and it just in time that I got the changing table and now she's not even a baby anymore so yay no I'm, I don't mean that literally I'm not really yaying I'm being sarcastic um I'm trying well let's just go with the green because we already have it it's cute it's mm, it goes well with her decor already so we're just gonna throw her a bed in there we'll keep her rug because yeah it's eh, maybe the rug should go yeah this rug should go it's super baby um let's see what the walls up oh lord okay let's see what the walls cut away no that didn't help okay with the walls up um, yeah, that's, that's fine. Uh, we'll, we'll put the giraffe in the corner. I mean, you gotta keep your stuffies. Like, she's still a kid. She's not a grown-up. So, we're going, oh, we'll just put them like that. She loves giraffes. I love giraffes. It's my favorite animal. In case you guys didn't know that. Okay, yeah, so I think her room looks perfectly fine and that was quick and easy um yeah 
Oh, so dad is like, he sh he's sleeping. Um, which she needs to get ready to do. Um, let's make sure she's not hungry. She's not hungry. Um, she could stand to use the bathroom. Um, walls down, walls down. I'm like, she could take a shower, even though, I mean, she just grew up, so she should take a shower just for the hay of it and whatnot. And then we're just going to have her go to sleep because there's nothing else better to do than just get ready to go to sleep. Um, why was she upset? I don't know. She's sleeping now. Um, Mama dear can, oh, because the toilet broke, can come and repair the broken toilet. And then she will go to bed. Where did she put that cup? Oh, she put it on the shelf. <laughs> Drink. She just put the cup on the, uh, way up on the shelf. Okay, so, um, clean out the spoiled food and cook a gourmet meal. Yeah, you can do that. Um, lobster thermidor, thermidor. I have not had that in forever. So we're going to make, I don't know why she just made party size, but that's fine because we're just going to eat it all up and whatnot. Yeah, it's almost, oh, it's almost her birthday. Oy, everybody's growing up so quickly. Okay, now I can um, put the aging thing off for a little while because I don't really want Mia to grow up anyway. So we're going to turn the aging off for a little while and... Yeah, so gameplay, lifespan. Oh, let's just put it on long. I think that would just help it. Right? Is that an I hope that that's enough. So we'll just we'll just do that. And if they age up too quickly, then We'll just turn it off before I don't I really don't want him he's nowhere near getting an adult I don't think so yeah he's got 75 days to become an adult so with that I think we're good like I don't mind if she gets to be an adult as long as they're just not elder um Mia's about to be an elder oh no 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 we need to turn it off no way can she be an alder. No way. So let's go back and turn the aging off because she just cannot be an alder yet. Um, how do we turn it off? Disable. Auto age. No. Is that how you turn? I don't know. Um, I don't want them to age at all. I... Yes. Mm, I don't want them to age at all. Yet that's not it. Mm, that's not it. Yeah, gameplay. So I'm thinking that that's it. I don't know. God, I feel like, I feel like a noob sometimes. Disable or select. I don't know. I think maybe turn this off. I, I don't know. I don't, okay. Okay, so, yeah. I don't want that. I don't know. I thought I turned it off with a different, you know what, I'll just edit her in um, cast if she get if they're still aging, I'll just edit her in cast and make her a young adult. 
and then she won't age, so. Or make her an adult, I don't know, whatever it is. I'm just gonna make her young again. So yay, um. I need to harvest. So she can go outside and harvest those and then she can come and go to bed after she gets done harvesting all of her items or just those I guess <laughs> okay I guess those weren't ready to harvest so okay oh crap I left the food out that's okay he's up yay he's up okay so um grab a serving I'm so like excited I want it to go like super fast and get yeah go pee wait 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 you gotta go pee I have a problem with people peeing on themselves and yeah we don't want that to happen let's check out this lobster th thermidor here oh it looks so much better on sims 3 yeah it looked more appetizing on sims 3 but that's all right. That is all right. And she's awake and hungry. So let her come and grab a serving also. I want her to be so perfect for her first day of school. So energized, so ready to go and get the day done and I hope she's gravy. Um, um, clean the bathroom. Because that's disgusting. Mop up the puddle. And then go and have yourself some of this lobster thermidor. Where is she? Oh, she's doing her dishes. What a tidy little. Oh, I just said that really funny. Little. Okay. I didn't mean to say it like that, but my tongue got kind of caught and it just, it just came out. It is what it is. We'll have her come and use the bathroom. And we're, well, what time does she start school? Two hours. So I think she has time to take a brisk shower so that she's energized because I know well, before you had to be energized for school so I'm not really sure what um oh my gosh I'm so excited okay unpleasant surroundings what's unpleasant sweetie bear I don't know I don't know And her social's really low. Let's have her come and give dad a pep talk. Okay, so we are going to go to school. And we are here. And I'm so excited. Um, where did I get this? I need to look and show you where this school is from. So I'm going to go into the gallery really quickly. So that I can tell you um, we got this school and it is from it's my 2815 and i basically got the elementary school because i loved the high school so i figured it would look cohesive if i got it from the same creator so the high school looks really cool and yeah so i got it from it's my 2815 so if you guys would like the elementary school that you will see um, Mona go to, I will, or you guys can just go get it from, yeah, because I'm not going to leave a link because I don't even really know how to do that because I've tried to link my gallery and it never works. So it never works out for me. So if you guys like that, just go to that one and 
and get it. So she is supposed to draw. So where is the little drawing table thingies? Maybe upstairs. Okay, here we go. So we'll have her come and draw shapes and and then I really want her to meet friends and have friends. Everybody else gets to play. Hey, chick, you got anger problems, little one. She just totally broke the dollhouse for everybody. And there's nobody here to repair it. There's no adults that can repair this. So she just broke it for everyone. Seriously, we do not like this. Antoinette Court, what was her name? Pause, we gotta see this chick. Cause she's like our nemesis now. We just do not even like her at all. She's probably really cute. Like a really cute kid and just a brat. Yeah, she's a brat. Her name is Antoinette Cordova and we don't like her. We do not like her, she's a brat. So, okay. She's like the bully chick that everybody dislikes. Or not everybody dislikes. That everybody um, likes and she just bullies people. She just bullied everybody by breaking that house. Oh my gosh, if he's not the cutest little kid. Ulysses. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Let's let's talk to him. He's so adorable. Um, a friendly introduction. Um, and then we'll go play the violin to get our what is this called? Our thingy up, yeah, our thingy. So we'll just have a quick little conversation with him. And that's enough of that. Otherwise, she'll stand there blabbing with him for hours. And we'll let her play the violin till she gets her points for it, which she did. So now we need to practice typing. So we'll just come in here and kick one of these kids off because there's so many of them on there. Let's... Is that Cordova? No. We're going to kick... Let's kick a boy off because honestly... She would, like, come in here and... Oh, he's he's getting off anyway. So let's practice typing. She'd come in here and she would smile. And he would graciously give her his computer. And sorry, chick, but you got to get up. You got to get up. You got to move. No, for real. You got you to gotta move. Oh, she's still in there practicing the violin. I forgot to click it off. Okay, so you got to move, dude. Alton, you got to move. Alton, you got to move. No, seriously. <laughs> Is he not going to move? What the hey, bro? Okay. <laughs> so I wonder if the other kids are trying to do the same as us. Like, get their little... See, I could have kicked... Look at her trying to be the boss in the teacher's desk. I told you she's a bully. I'm not even kidding. She is the freaking bully of the school. She's like the pop... Look at... She has on eyeliner too. Like she... She's like evil. Look at her. Oh. Wow. And Mona's just so sweet and innocent. She's our sweet little girl. Okay. So she needs to go and experiment. So we'll click this off and let somebody else use it. Experiment. And we probably won't get the highest score today because I'm new to this and yeah. Whatevs. It's not, as long as we get a good day, you know, 
I'm I'm happy. Who like I'm so excited. Like this is like the coolest thing ever. Like look at them walking. They're just so cute. They just walked into class together. Like I want to make friends with everybody except for that girl cuz she's not cool at all. She is a brat. So should we just got... What else is there? Okay, we can like play on the monkey thingies. Okay, we're done. So what do we do next? Socialize with cat classmates. Finally! Okay, so um, she's going poop. We don't, we don't want to talk to her. Um, let's talk to Kale because she's adorable and we will talk with Kale and she looks very friendly. She looks like somebody we would have be friends with. So let's find her and then I want to find that one girl because she yeah her she's so cute and oh my gosh I want to become best friends with Tessa. I'm not even kidding. Her and Tessa should be besties. It's it's a must that they become friends. Okay, can we stay late? I want I want to yeah. Let's stay late. I want to stay as long as I can, and I want to meet Tessa for sure. For sure, Z's. Become friends with Tessa. Um, oh, you got to socialize with a lot of different, okay, so not just one, just a lot. Um, friendly introduction, then um, complain about parents. No, she would never do that. Where, where, where is that? She would never do that. She's a good kid. Loves her mom and dad. And talk about toys. We're just going to chat it up with Tessa because I want them to be friends. Bright and day. Um, what else? Oh, I would never call her names. Um, or make fun of adults. That's just not. Tell a goofy story. And what else? Enthused about candy. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Make a silly face. Heartfelt compliment. Because you really like her. Talk about favorite animal, which is a giraffe. Um, do an impression. What else? Joke about nacho cheese. Okay, so once we get all of those. Okay, so, um, discuss interests, what else, um, talk about toys, monkey around, play make-believe, oh my gosh, that's adorable, well, why would I get a negative moodlet, uh -oh. does she not like me? Oh, he thinks it's an offensive conversation. I don't know. I don't know what's up with him. I don't know. Um, quote a cartoon character. And... She already re reached the social level of... Three. Wow. Goof around. Um, talk about school. And one more. Um, get to know because we really like her and we are going to become best friends I like her hat I'm so like amazed by how cute she is just want to get to know her and yeah become besties with her I actually got a full bar I actually did it on the first day. I am so 
so excited for that. That is so cool. Um, let's tell her a goofy story and play make believe. They are such good friends. Um, monkey around. And yeah, so that was it for the day, which I'm so happy. You guys have to like this video for me because it makes my heart so happy to be playing this right now. You guys don't even know. I like this. I really do. If you guys don't have this mod, you should totally get it because it is so fun. It's so awesome. And I just can't say enough good things about how cool it is. So you don't get any money, obviously. But how fun was that? Okay, so Mona is done with school for the day. She is going, she's doing satisfactory work, but her teachers, which there isn't even any, um, at Land Grab, hey, I was reading that. <laughs> her teachers at Land Grab Elementary, which is not even Land Grab Elementary, but anyway, okay, think she could easily improve with just a little bit of extra effort, which, BS because we did great and yeah so okay so she'll get better moodlets from watching something some I don't know so okay so I'm going to end this part here um, like if you are in love with little Mona here. Um, she's so cute and adorable and I'm so excited and happy to have her in this LP. So you guys like, like smash the like button all up. So smash the like button, subscribe if you have not already. Um, and yeah, that's about it. I'm over the moon and completely in love with this part of this LP right here. It was so much fun and shout out to Zerbu for making this mod. Thank you so much. And yeah, I'm going to stop blabbing and go to bed now because I'm entirely too tired. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you guys. I will see you in the next part of whatever I make. Bye-bye.